This is Auntie Eva reading Dharma the Lama by Matt Cosgrove and this is especially for Jodie on her fourth birthday. Happy birthday. Have you met Dharma? Dharma's a Lama. She likes picking flowers and reading for hours and hours and hours. Is that a bit like you? Dharma lives with a herd who thinks she's absurd. Because, as you can see, she does things quite differently. When the herd wake up, Dharma says, Nap! When the herd says, good night, Dharma turns on her light. <clears throat> they go up high. She says, bye. While they're stampeding, Dharma's reading. She doesn't see their dirty looks, so happy buried in her books, caught up in the pleasure of searching for treasure. or with an alien race in deep outer space. Or riding broomsticks, doing magic tricks. One particular day, in their typical way, the herd were all jeering. They were too busy sneering to notice the sign. Uh-oh. And so, in a line, they fell with a thud in a big pit of mud. Flop. Plop. We're stuck in this mud. It's icky and yucky. Dharma heard them all yelp and rushed there to help. From the books she had read, a plan formed in her head. What do you think she's going to do? Let's find out. She swung in with a smile, dashing pirate style, and pulled out a lot, shouting, X marks the spot! Dharma's next resort, like an astronaut, was a dazzling exposition of a weightless rescue mission. She's 
pretty clever. And then finally, on a branch in the tree, Dharma's last rescue trick. No, it wasn't magic. A ladder made from rope was the Lama's only hope. Dharma knew what to do. She read non-fiction too. Do you? The last Lama's climbed out and were left with no doubt it sure pays to read, they all had to concede. For being such a smarty, they threw Dharma a big party. Thanks Dharma, you're the best. But she skipped the grand proceeding. She was far too busy reading. I hope you enjoyed listening to Dharma the Lama. Infinite love and gratitude.